Hi everyone and welcome to the channel. I am Akesh Rasveer. So let us in this session I have two important topics for you. As I think I, uh, you have already seen the thumbnail of the video. I am going to discuss about cultural studies and only one concept from cultural studies. And from deconstruction, so only and only one concept. If you are preparing for UG Senior upcoming exam, so as these both topic are most important topic. Most of the time I have seen questions from cultural studies and deconstruction. So you can't avoid. Let us if you are interested on my free classes, so you can also watch me on an academy the learning application. For free classes, follow me there. Next day at 3 p.m. learners, there will be a class, so that is a practice session. Now learners, see the first one slide. This is. So, M. H. Abraham. He is famous for his work, Glossary of Literary Term. Let us, you must understand this one book is the most important book, Glossary of Literary Term. For every single UG Senate or TGTBVT or any other exam aspirant, in English, let us, if you are preparing for any exam, must read book. Let us, M.H. Abraham. So, he has written a work. What is the name of this work, learners, particularly? So, see, the Deconstructive Angel. This is the name of the work, Deconstructive Angel. And on, learners, this work, you are going to see something. Amish Abraham is going to say, there is a fixed and univocal meaning for a text. And if we use deconstructive strategies, history will become impossibility. Let us how. So try to understand the fact. Deconstruction talks about the decentering of meaning. As deconstruction, so let us the thing that is constructed, so deconstruction is going to break the center of the thing. Deconstruction talks about that, that there is no fixed or center of meaning of a particular text. There is no center of any text. M. H. Abraham says, if there is no center, if there is no clear-cut meaning or fixed meaning of a text, so how history can be considered as the truth one. Yes, learners. Aapke bhi mind me ye same question hona chahiye. Ki agar koi ek perfect or fixed meaning nahi hai. So it means history becomes impossibility. Now learners, after this particular statement by M. H. Abrams, he received a reply from a deconstructive critic named J. H. Miller Lemons. Must understand the name J. H. Miller. So he received a response from Miller. Let us basically Miller what Miller is going to say. But let us see uh, uh, before proceeding to Miller. Focus on MH Abraham. So on deconstructive angelness, one more thing you can see. MH Abraham said that deconstructive meaning is kind of parasite. Let us you can understand parasite per GV. Parasite learners, it means a parasite that used to stick on another's body. Other body. And let us usi se wo apna bhojan lene wala hai. Going to prepare meal. 
So deconstructive meaning it's kind of parasite. Let us there were two figure major figure who were talking about this concept let us parasite deconstructive meaning a kind of parasite. One is must remember students please do note down M H Abrams. I have written in short. And another one. So W A Y N E and B double O T H E. Let us see. Van Booth is there. So these are the two figures who were talking about the parasite over meaning. Deconstructive meaning is a kind of parasite. Now let us see the reply given by J. H. Miller. Let us must understand the work I'm, I was talking about the deconstructive angel by M. H. Abraham. So that was published on the same year 1976. In the same season, J. H. Miller. So J. H. Miller has written an work on Linus. This is an AC, and this is considered as the reply to M. H. Abrams, who claimed that yes, Linus, who claimed what he claimed basically. So Linus, he claimed that this is a kind of parasite. Let us now try to understand where these two works were presented. So deconstructive angel, deconstructive, T R U C T I V E, deconstructive angel by M H Abrahamus. Try to understand M H Abrahamus. This was appeared in one nine seven six, and the critic as host by G H Miller. So this was also presented at the same season. Where Linus, so yes, this was the season at Modern Language Association in December 1976. Deconstructive Angel 1976 and the Critic as Host 1976. And where these two were presented, so Modern Language Association on this season, students. Okay. So after MH Abraham, Miller presented the video. And what he is going to say basically. So in the critique as host, J. S. Miller replies. And let us, this is a kind of elaborate reply, detailed reply to M. S. Abrams' claim that this is uh, the meaning that is parasite. So let us, he has given the reply that deconstruction are nothing but parasite. Let us, this was the claim made by deconstructive angel written by M. S. Abrams. So now let us is going to say Miller's begins his paper with quote from Thackeray's novel Henry Esmond. Let us this was the part of your UG Senate exam. And critique as host let us this was also part of your UG Senate exam. Must understand let us most important topic I am discussing. So do subscribe the channel if you have not subscribed till now. Let us see. So Miller began his paper with a quotation from Thackeray as a Henry Esmond. And he is going to say, quote, demonstrates the complex relationship between the parasite and the host. What is the connection between a parasite and host? So let us must understand both ACs. The critique as a host and then let us the deconstructive angel. So deconstructive angel ka jo reply hai, so that is the critique as host by Miller. The critique as host by Miller. Now, learners, uh, I'm going to talk about the next important topic for the class. Learners, this is all about encoding and decoding model in cultural study. So, first of all, learners, you must understand what is encoding and decoding. Learners, if I said Hamlet. All honest, I have written this particular, this particular word in a page, or I have passed it. I So then, after reading these words, H A M L E T, you are going to get something. It means you are going to get that uh, Hamlet is a play, a drama. 
and it was written by William Shakespeare, the Elizabethan and Jacobian playwright, or whatever learners you know about Hamlet. On the same way, encoding works in the same way. Let us, if, if you have written these words, and after reading these words, someone realized that the meaning of these words is Hamlet, a play. So it means, learners, he has decoded these words. On the same way, Stuart Hall. Stuart Hall, learners, he was also associated with CCCS. What is the full form of CCS? CCCS. Let us do write on comment box. So Stuart Hall in 1973, he has written an essay, Encoding and Decoding in the Television Discourse. On television learners, you are going to see an advertisement. And what is there on that advertisement? There is a boy or a girl tasting noodles and going to say it's yummy all learners c is or he is going to create an expression and after that expression or that word yummy you are considering that the thing he is eating is really tasty one on the same way on newspapers all in a any advertisement focus on the car's advertisement. A space for everything in a sexy voice. A space for everything. Advertising a girl on car and saying a space for everything. So learners, uh, this is a kind of encoding and you are going to decade a space for everything. Or you will understand On the same way, learners, so Stuart Hall was interested in the studies of television discourses, different kind of tele television program and even learners newspaper. This was the first time when someone was ready to study these all things. Almost learners every time we are living a life and we are slave follower of someone others. And in which way? So try to understand in which way. Because let us, we are going to adopt a queen, we are going to adopt a duo, or we are going to adopt anything else. The way how to eat, what to eat, and what not to eat, which product is best and which one, which one is worst. We are not going to decide that tea by Tata made by Tata or tea made by Hindustan Unilever Limited, which one is best. But a celebrity comes on his screen and he is going to, he or she is going to say, Oh wow, this is the tea that contains taste of something else or taste of any other thing learners, whatever you can say, so whatever you can think. So on this way learners, Stuart Hall was interested to study these kind of encoding. And he was interested to decode these all kind of things. And he was focusing on it. Hall proposed that audience members can play an active role in decoding messages as they really on their own social contacts. And might be capable of changing messages themselves through collective action. If someone is going to say this brand is best, so you can say with your collective action, no, this is not best. I have taken this one. This one is the best. So this was a kind of study made by Stuart Hall in his essay Encoding and Decoding in Television Discourse. So learners, I think encoding. So learners, writing of something or accent or a kind of gesture. It may be through verbal language and um, non-verbal language. You can understand. So Stuart Hall was focusing on the television and the newspapers. In England, and he was trying to focus on the working class society because let us after seeing that this brand, particular this brand, the cloth of this brand is best. So working class, those who have no, um, who have no, a lot of resources, economic resources, 
एंड दे आर ड्रीमिंग आफ्टर वियरिंग दिस वन इट मे बी की हमारा जो लुक है वो ड्रेसिंग हो जाए सो स्टूअर्ट हॉल ने इस पर कोशिश की थी स्टडी की सो डस दिस इज ऑल अबाउट इनकोडिंग एंड डिकोडिंग मॉडल गिवन बाई स्टूअर्ट हॉल इन हिज एस एन टाइडल इनकोडिंग एंड डिकोडिंग इन दूस इन दिस कोर्स and previously learners we have this we have already covered about the deconstructive ensemble and then learners the critic as host so thank you so much learners for watching this wonderful session and in my upcoming classes learners i am going to take another one important points that will be really helpful for your upcoming ug cnet exam on youtube platform learners it is not possible to complete everything because uh, we have a few foundation like uh, streaming quality internet quality and sometime learners uh, interaction because if i am going to stream a class so learners jab main stream karunga so jo aapke comment hai wo mujhe kafi late milte hain so that's why learners जो बेस्ट कॉम्बिनेशन है वो नहीं मिल पाता बट लर्नस अन अकेडमी के प्लेटफॉर्म में लर्नस आई एम नॉट सेइंग कि आप सब्सक्रिप्शन ही लीजिए आप जस्ट डाउनलोड कीजिए और आप वहां पर फॉलो कीजिए मुझे और फ्री क्लासेस आप देख सकते हैं पेपर वन एंड पेपर टू बोथ पेपर्स। बट लर्नस वट इज देयर सो देर इज ए फंक्शन वी आर गोइंग टू गिव अ पोल सो लर्नस ऑन दैट पोल यू कैन अटैम द्वेशन यस दिस वन इज करेक्ट सो ए बी सी डी यू कैन सेलेक्ट फ्रॉम योर मोबाइल अनादर वन थिंग लर्नस वेन एवर यू आर राइट गोइंग टू राइट अ क्वेरी so within within learners one two second we are going to focus on your masses we are going to get your masses and on youtube that is not possible so learners keep on watching on youtube and keep on watching on an academy platform thank you so much learners next class mein main fir se milunga tab tak ke liye namaskar aur subscribe zarur kijiyega aur share kar dijiyega apne friends ke sath thank you so much learners jaldi hi aapse mulakat karta hu